Henri Matisse was a contemporary of Picasso and they, they had very parallel careers in certain ways, but they were very different characters. Um, Matisse first burst onto the scene as, as the leader, in a way, of the fauve movement, the, the wild beasts as they were called, and their paintings were about hot, expressive colour. Um, and then Matisse went through a more experimental phase, or well, even, even more experimental phase, um, of ab almost abstraction. And then he moved to Nice in the south of France at the end of the 19 teens and made his home there for most of the rest of his career. And, and the painting behind me, which is called The Odalisque with Magnolias, is a wonderful example of his style in the mid 1920s working in Nice. And Matisse has taken the subject of the Odalisque, or the, the female nude, um, because it was something that was very much approved and sanctioned by, by art history. Matisse was keen, like Picasso, to measure himself against the masters of the past times and great French 19th century artists such as Delacroix and Ingres had painted famous odalisques. So Matisse took up the challenge and this is his version of it. It was also a reference to, to, to sculpture of the Renaissance time. There's, there's a, a reference here to Michelangelo's um, figure of night from the Medici Chapel in Florence. Um, but also, it's, it's very much a synthesis, this picture. So it includes Matisse's other love of, of, of color and pattern. So we have both um, natural pattern, which is the fruits and the, the, um, the magnolias, which have been pinned onto a, a silk screen. And there you have the man-made pattern of, of the, the fabrics, the silk fabrics, some with organic shapes and others with the, the geometric um, striped green couch that she's lying on. So all of this is, goes towards creating this, um, almost this utopia, this sort of nirvana that, that Matisse was seeking to find in his pictures. They wanted them to be places of rest, places of solace. Um, they were without the, the anxiety, perhaps, that, that you find in certain Picasso paintings. They were a, a, a more poetic space, I suppose one could say. Uh, this picture that was bought by the Rockefellers from a famous Chicago collection in the late 1950s and, and hung on the sitting room wall in their country house since then.